Hey there, let's read what is probably the most famous fable. It will be read out of our Book of Aesop's Fables that was selected and adapted by Lewis Untermeyer and illustrated by Alison Martin Provinson. And today's fable is The Hare and the Tortoise. There's all our spectators watching the race. And there I see the hare, which is another word for a rabbit. It's, it's a little bit different kind of rabbit. And a tortoise, which is of course like a turtle. So, the hare and the tortoise. A hare was always boasting about his speed and sneering at a tortoise because he was so slow. One day the tortoise said, you may laugh at me, but if we ever had a race, I know I could beat you. Ridiculous, said the hare. Is it, said the tortoise. We shall see. Are you ready? They started up at once, and of course the hare quickly outran the tortoise, who merely crawled along. The hare, in fact, was so far ahead that he treated the whole matter as a joke and lay down. I'll take a little nap here in the grass, he said to himself, and when I wake up, I'll finish the race far ahead. Nevertheless, the hare overslept himself, and when he arrived at the finish line, the tortoise, who had plodded steadily along, was there ahead of him. The race is not always to the swift. Slow and steady wins the race. I say probably one of the most famous fables and morals of, of all of it is up. But I always think, isn't fast and steady better? Oh, I have been this fable. You think fast and steady would win the race. Maybe the moral should be something about not being distracted. <laughs> Even if you're if you're ahead, don't beat yourself. Don't get distracted and don't don't lose the race just because you um, kind of forgot to finish it. Anyway, that was our fable for today, the hare and the tortoise. We'll be reading another one very soon.